Welcome to Microsoft Dynamics CX 2012 Quick Tip Series. I'm Rakesh Pandey and I'm a project manager with over 17 years of IT experience. Today I'm going to demonstrate how we can utilize select query on Dynamics CX 2012 reports to add flexibility to the reports created from Dynamics CX, which is one of the most important tools for businesses in making. We will be using one of the sales and marketing open orders report as an example. This gives me a report with all the open sales orders into system. Navigate to sales and marketing. Under reports you have sales orders, open sales orders report. Here you can see the select button which you can use to add a condition to the report. You can also use this to add related tables and add additional criteria based on related tables. Click the select button. Now right click on the open sales order table. You will see two options, one is to n and n is to one. which indicates the relationship of current table to the tables being added. Select n is to 1. Select the sales order table. Now in the lower section you will be able to add criteria based on sales order table. Click on add. Select the sales order table. Select a field or its type. So you can choose any field to define your criteria. I'm choosing order type for uh, so that I'm able to pull out uh, all the order type based on various uh, types of orders. Say journal here. You can save this as an inquiry for repetitive use. You can also create multiple inquiries using different criteria. Create one with sales orders as well. Save this. Now click OK to save and go back. Here you will see a new criteria has been added with from the sales order table on orders type. Click on OK to run the report. You can uh, expand the options pass tab to select a different select query which you saved as inquiry as well. Run this again. This can be a very effective tool in creating report with different criteria. I hope you enjoyed the presentation. Thank you.